Welcome to your reading. <coughs> I'm sorry. This is your August the 21st to August the 22nd of 2020. This is for Aries Ascendant. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus placement on their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. Cross watchers, if I describe someone here and you know that it is not you, it is not you. Okay. For those of you who's new to the channel, you might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming and there you go. On a live stream, you can ask me questions. If you're going to join the live streaming, what I can strongly suggest is for you to have patience. Okay. If you are impatient and you're feeling entitled, um live reading is not for you okay instead i would uh, suggest to do a personal reading let's leave it like that let's all be positive today and <coughs> aries if you resonate with the reading congratulations if you do not resonate with the reading come back to the reading after a week or two time is fluid if you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading then still congratulations for i am doing a collective reading if you miss the live streaming and you have a question okay there is a link in the description box click that link you'll be routed to my page type in your question and then click submit i'm sorry let me just adjust the camera so that you can see all of your spread don't forget to follow the instructions okay so Aries, if you also want to know your lucky number and lucky color, follow me on Instagram. There's a link in the description box. Let me put it here so that you can see them all. Okay. So there are mystery cards here. Okay, um, I just want to let you know that that is... This will be revealed if you have 500 likes for this video your next video will be like leo we reveal all the cards and you'll have your full reading okay so aries if you want your video to be a full reading or if you have a leo placement you can check leo's um reading you might pick up some bits and pieces of yourself in that reading and leo also leo <laughs> aries all right we have an announcement okay we will have fun in the channel since we are family here okay if you want your picture to be featured in the thumbnail we will not use other people okay we will use a real person real connection real love okay so if you want your pictures to be featured in the thumbnail Follow me on Instagram, send us your picture, but it's not a selfie of yourself. It can be a selfie, but a couple, okay? So we can feature that in the um, in the thumbnail on the next video, okay? Follow me on Instagram. So, Aries, if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, come back to the reading after a week or two. Time is fluid. If you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading, then start congratulations for I'm doing a collective reading. I think I said that. Let's begin. Your first card is King of Wands and the Four of Pentacles. Someone is hiding the truth. Someone wants to communicate, but someone is kind of, wait, I'm not ready yet to talk to you. Okay? Someone is also afraid of saying something right um kind of afraid because the other person might be a little sinister okay but as i can see here someone is holding back a secret someone wanted to go with someone else that's for a few numbers of you okay but a promise of the sun is here Something will change as I am speaking right now. Uranus is in retrograde. So there will be a lot of changes. 
and these changes will surprise you because you feel like you it's a hopeless situation it's a hopeless connection it's a hopeless person that you are connecting with um it feels like your person is you feel like this connection is dying you feel something in you is dying because the other person is not paying attention in this connection actually they're giving their attention to something or someone else or somewhere else okay you have to make a better judgment here because there might be some situation that your person may not talk your person might also be attracted to someone not because they want it they could be hexed or they could be like let's say seduced by other persons so it's kind of like a hex right if you are seducing someone you're trying to summon someone so you know that this person that you are connecting with is or it could be you um is weak when it comes to physical you know sexual pleasures to pleasing to their eyes you know aesthetics if i may say so you also have a lot of ideas on probably how to make this connection works i can see here that what you want in this connection is an equal give and take okay um i think your person is now understanding what is what's the connection is about but the other person still lingers on to a third wheel because they are being attracted okay they they're being seduced there will come to a time that your person will disconnect this connection i mean cut this connection it could be you it could be the cross watchers but see i told you seven of seven of cups is here someone is you know someone will place you in a in an option it could be you it could be the cross watchers cross watchers if you feel like this is your reading so be it and if Aries, if you feel like you are on the cross watcher side, that is okay. I'm not reading which side you at anyway. I'm reading the energy. But someone here is being seduced and that is for sure. So I can see here that you felt like this connection is hopeless. Six of swords, things are going to go or things will go to a calmer water. The sun is here. It's a promise. Okay. You're going to receive a communication here probably from the person or from other people that your person is doing something i think you're going to save your connection okay you're not going to you're not going to put the uh you know yes you may pray send the uh, your prayers to the universe to help you but you're going to take action to save this connection you are actually um as i can see here you're actually planning this you have ideas in your head you have a lot of ideas on how to save this connection probably for a few numbers of you your person actually you know put i mean do numbers on you walked upon you already turned their back on this connection yes they do because they are being guided here to a dark place seduced by other person the sun showed up here twice so Whatever that you are planning, execution is needed. Okay, If you need to cut this connection so that your person can understand how valuable you are, so be it. Yes, you might get hurt, but you're, but you're going to receive a communication here. They're going to give you an equal give and take. Probably you're getting less of what you deserve in this connection. So seven of, I can see here seven, seven, seven. I can also see that the seven of uh, cups here, they're going to be awakened. Okay, seven of swords. You might be connecting with Capricorn or has a Capricorn placement on their chart or you have a Capricorn placement on your chart. As I can see that this person is a little manipulative, if I may say. Um, they're hiding secrets from you. Aries, this is your reading. If you are, if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. All right. Aries, if you want to go in depth, you can book a personal reading with me. You can contact me. If you're okay with the reading and you just have a question or two, there's a link in the description box. Click that link. You'll be routed to my page. Type in your question. Click submit. 500 likes <coughs> for this video. Your next video will be a full reading. And 
send us your photo so that we can use that as we can use that to actually um, as a thumbnail okay um, thank you so much for watching love and light to you namaste see you in the next reading goodbye